something that emotionally intelligent people do not do is use fear as a reason to not do something. So obviously there's healthy fear, like you shouldn't go jump off a cliff, um, you shouldn't eat a random mushroom you found. Those are good things to not do. But most of us are not dealing with this type of fear. Most of us, the type of fear that keeps us awake or keeps us ruminating and thinking thoughts all over and over in our minds is the type of fear of failure. Like we're afraid of trying something, of doing something and being exposed as a failure or failing at something that's important to us. And that type of fear, that is the fear that's blocking you from doing the things that matter to you, from living the life that you want. And that fear is not a sign that you are on the wrong path. It is not a sign that you shouldn't do something. It just means that your mind is engaging in a normal psychological defense. So whenever we think of something that's outside of our kind of comfort zone, the mind will engage a psychological defense. It will give you fear. And so the way the psychological defense works is that it gives you little thoughts of fear, like, oh, what if this happens? Or what if that happens? Or if I look really stupid? Or if, you know, like X, Y, Z happens. And a lot of times they're a little bit irrational. But when you don't realize that the psychological defense is a part of the normal working of your mind, you start to use it as evidence for not doing something. But if you expect the psychological defense to come each time you try to get out of your little comfort zone circle, then you realize it's normal. And every time you try to grow, every time you try to take a bit of a risk, you're going to have the psychological defense. And it's, you know, like, it's just kind of like I said in a previous video, like it's a kind of having like an annoying neurotic friend that follows you around and tells you like random things that like are scary. But that doesn't mean you shouldn't do it. It doesn't mean you should listen to this random neurotic friend. It just means that the psycho psychological defense has been engaged because you're going outside of the comfort zone. And that doesn't mean that you shouldn't.